Hey guys, welcome to my new video. In today's video, I will show you how to get the Distance Horizons mod in Minecraft 1.21. As you can see, I'm really into Minecraft 1.21 and everything's working just fine. I'm also using the Bliss shaders. So let me show you how to get all of this in your Minecraft. So let's get right into that. So what you need to do now is to go to the video description and there are three download links. Please click on the first one, it will take you to this article on the Distant Horizons mod for Minecraft 1.21. And once you are in here, please scroll down until you get to the download section, as you can see in here. And click on the first link, which says uh, Download Distant Horizons mod for Minecraft. Then go back to the video description and click on the second link, it will take you to the article on Fabric. So please make sure you download the Fabric and Fabric AP, we need both of these files. And the last link is for the iris shaders. So again, please scroll down and what you need to do is to download iris shaders only in here. Then take all those files and drop it on the desktop. As you can see, I've already did it. So we've got the Distance Horizons, 121 Indium, Fabric AP and Iris Installer. What we need to do now is to open up the Windows search bar, type in percent app data percent. Hit enter, this will open up the roaming folder for us and in here go to the .minecraft, find mods, so let me find mods, okay here we are, and what you need to do now is to take the fabric AP, drop it in the mods, then indium, and distant horizons, all three. Now, double click on iris installer, and in here we need to go back and find the versions folder and select the 1.21 version and select iris plus fabric hit install and uh, hit yes and now just check that you can see the iris one uh, the fabric this one this one uh, the iris fabric loader 1.21 now go back and uh, recheck the mod folder and as you can see it installed the iris and sodium mod which is fine so now we can close it and let's open up Minecraft Launcher and I'll show you one more thing because you may get lags and stuff like that with Distance Horizons. So let me show you how to quickly fix that. It's pretty easy, we just need to make sure that we allocate more RAM uh, to the game uh, and with that we can get uh, rid of those uh, lags. So just let, give me a, a couple of seconds. So here we are, go to the installations and this is the fabric loader and it has the distance horizons mod in it. So click three dots, hit edit and more options. As you can see, I've got 16 G in here, but you, you will have two G. Please make sure that you use 50% of your RAM's capacity. So for example, if you have 16 gigabytes of RAM, you would use 8 G. And if you have 8 gigabytes of RAM, you would use 4 G. Just make sure you use 50% of the RAM's capacity. I have uh, 32 gigabytes of RAM, so that's why I use 16G. And uh, this is basically uh, what fixed my lags because I've got a great PC, but I still had lags because I've, I have had allocated only two gigabytes of RAM. So here, here we are in the Minecraft 121. If we go to the options, you can see that the distance horizon is, is right here. So let me just open up the, the the TGK word, which is my word, and I'll show you again that everything's working just fine. As you can see, we are in here, in here. We've got the wind wind charge. I think that's the name. Okay, yeah, that's that's it. And just take a look. Oh, finally, I know where's the next village, which is great, and everything looks pretty insane. Uh, I will leave a comment, uh, not the comment, but a link for the Bliss shader as well, because look at it, it's, it's unreal. This is really unreal and I love to play with the Distance Horizons shaders and models also, because it's, 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 it's just unreal. So thank you so much guys for watching this video, I hope I have helped you with uh, this issue. In case you've got any issues or problems or just you just want to ask me anything, please let me know down in the comments. I'll help you with anything. Thank you so much and see you soon.